Hi there, this is Terry from Tree Marie Soapworks, and today I'm going to show you how I line my squeeze bottles and also how I make the extensions. Both of these tips I got from the Soap Challenge Club, so if you ever have any interest in learning lots and expanding your knowledge, I would highly suggest the Soap Challenge Club. That is hosted by Amy Warden, and I will leave a link below. Before we get started with the liners, I clean the tips of the squeeze bottles with isopropyl alcohol, and I dry them off very well just to make sure that the tape will adhere to them. The liners are just sealed air packaging that you get in your shipments. You usually probably throw those away, but this is somewhat of a way of recycling and using them again. You could also use baby bottle liners or any other kind of bag, but ideally you want something that's long and skinny. Next, where the packaging pillows were sealed, you just cut off the top. To get these liners inserted into your squeeze bottles, just use the dull end of a chopstick. To make the extension, use a pipette or a straw, but the pipette works really well. You can find these at soap supply companies and also Amazon carries them. The ones I'm using here are three milliliter and I cut it at the two mil line. Then I cut a little fringe around the edge so it can splay open over the tip of the cap. To finish it off, I press the pipettes onto the cap and I tape them in place with the electrical tape. There are so many ways you can use squeeze bottles in soap making. I showed you a few of the soaps that I made with a squeeze bottle at the beginning of this video. And also I've used the extension and other things. One of the things is to use it on a glue bottle. I did that in the dividers video and it made it so much easier. Thanks so much for watching today and if you'd like to see more videos like this please hit the thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and comment below if you have any ideas of videos you want me to make. I'm making an effort to produce a lot more videos than I did last year. I have a few that are already in the works and as soon as I get them edited I'll get them to you so stay tuned and have a great day.